been a lot of crazy finishes in this, uh, and that was one of them. Oh, you know, we seventh end, I missed a draw, or he probably has a hard time getting more than one. I missed the draw, he has a crack at, at three, he gets his three. I was hoping to get two coming home and force the extra end, and then we got a, we got a big fortunate uh, for us, a miss on the... Uh, his last rock, so got got lucky for sure. And I guess it just just goes to show you, you know, you just keep plugging away, and then it just takes one miss in this game. Yeah, yeah at our level, uh, we got to we got to make some shots too. It's one of those games where um, you know we each missed some shots, we made, each made some great shots. It was back and forth; anything could have happened, and uh, we got a last minute break that, that we really needed, and uh, took advantage of it, and uh, got us to the final. Now you get to play uh, Ontario. Yeah, I, we haven't played him, of course. I don't know Greg at all, but uh, we're hoping to have a good game and uh, maybe sneak one out on him. <laughs> good luck. All right, thank you. Thank you. Look like your team played really well, and then you make that big shot to finish the game. That must be a good feeling. It was a good feeling. I wasn't calling for the double. It was kind of a bonus, actually. Just wanted to get rid of one of them and then have my last shot to win the game. You must feel pretty good about the way your team's playing going into a, a final. I do. It's really quick ice, which we're not quite used to, but we're adapting to it really well, and everyone's playing great. And you get to play Ontario. We sure do. And you haven't played them in this because you were in a different pool, so what do you know about them? Not a whole lot, just that their record was 6-0, and so it's going to be a good game. Grab control early and just, you know, just didn't make that enough, you know, or they didn't make enough shots to make the comeback. Yeah, we, uh, we took a four in the, the second end there and kept them pretty clean after that. Um, didn't really have an opportunity, a good opportunity to, to um, switch gears and go for a steal. I mean, we were uh, all peeling re very, very well, so uh, we just kept it uh, nice and simple. Looked like a good team game. Look like your team played really well. They did. They did. They all played uh, very well. Um, we didn't have to throw a lot of, you know, come around, tap back, you know, hack, wait, only can see half a rock. So, I mean, like we were throwing our hits very well, and, and um, the guys are playing great. And you uh, looks like you got a good matchup in the final too. Yeah, Alberta looks like they're playing very well, and uh, looking forward to it. All four semifinals ended almost the same time. We got a high performance clinic coming up, and you have to get ready for a final, and you must be looking forward to that. Absolutely, we are so excited. This is what we came for. Kind of feel like we just won bragging rights for Ontario, and now we want to win bragging rights for Canada. I saw you uh, kind of sitting and posing for pictures with the Ontario men, yep. and that must be a pretty cool feeling to have both teams undefeated and going to the final. Yeah, it's really neat, and it's nice to have them to talk to about the rocks and the sheet and to have their support and also their fans' support, so it's been wonderful. And I understand you want to say hi to somebody. I would love to say hi to everyone at the High Park Club. Thank you so much for all of your notes and messages. We love it. Keep them coming, and uh, hopefully we'll bring it home for you.